such a time as this. And welcome back to For Such a Time as This, the place where there is no such thing as a silent witness. We always want to speak about current events here at FSTT, but through a biblical lens. With that said, let's put the lens of the Bible on this um, video we have here. Um, uh, Proverbs 18, 2, a fool takes no pleasure in understanding, but only in expressing his opinion. The fool believes every word they hear, but wise people think carefully about everything. Think carefully about everything. That's what the wise person does. A fool is only, only interested in what? Expressing his or her opinion. Um, uh, with that said, Whew. the rhetoric being spewed from that great journalistic um, wise TV show, The View, they are now openly calling for people to be jailed who disagree with them. All. And look, I, I, but I think that's an incredibly relevant question. Yeah. And I think DOJ, in the same way that it is uh, setting up a task force to investigate oligarchs, should look into people who are Russian propagandists and shilling for Putin. That's being, if you are a foreign asset uh, to a dictator, mm -hmm. it should be investigated. In fact, I remember when Tulsi Gabbard, mm -hmm. and I even hate that we're discussing it because I think to myself, who is this woman? She's a, you know, she's no longer in Congress. She's a failed presidential candidate yeah. she only pra practically exists on twitter and the fact that we're giving her oxygen is what makes her relevant that we're talking about her on hot topics but on the other hand how do you not call out something that is repeating mm -hmm. false russian propaganda well, that has been brought down they used to arrest people for doing stuff like this if they thought you were uh colluding with a russian agent if they thought you were putting out information or taking information and handing over to russia yeah. they used Used to actually investigate stuff like this and I guess now you know there seems to be no bars and people are not being told to hate Putin Putin doesn't need a reason to be hated it's pretty much clear he started a war he started a war. um I think most of the ladies on The View were entertainers. I know Whoopi was a comedian. I know Jay Bo Joy Behar was a comedian. I think uh, the one lady, I think her name is Sunny. She She's a, a lawyer. Uh, she's a legal analyst. Uh, I think the other young lady is a, an actress. Uh, but they're entertainers. They're actors. They're calling for political enemies to be rounded up, investigated. Tulsi Gabbard, of course, I don't agree with everything, but to say that she's a Russian agent or whatever word they used, Why don't you invite her on the show and have her, have her defend herself? I'm sure she'd go, but that would never happen. That that, that would never that, that would never happen. They wouldn't. They would not want true debate. Why? Because a fool takes no pleasure in understanding, but only in expressing his opinion. This is the discussion now. 
you're starting to see this over and over and over and over that if you disagree with the American left, if you disagree with them, you're a traitor. I don't think this is going to stop. I don't think this is going to stop. Christians, we, we need to be ready. We need to be ready. Because I do believe all of this is being orchestrated by the enemy, the adversary. And his ultimate goal is not the destruction not the destruction of the political right. The ultimate goal is the church of Jesus Christ. For such a time as this, 